took a shower, ate some breakfast, brushed my teeth, got ready because tonight, well, today, we're going to, um, a, like a fancy lunch place. It's apparently where celebrities eat and Nico wants to see a celebrity, so we're gonna eat there. Um, it's real expensive, so we're gonna share something. I don't know if I can afford it, so that's pretty cool. I didn't bring like enough makeup, like foundation stuff. I just brought like mascara and lip liner, but now I wish, or eyeliner, well, lip liner too. But now I wish I'd brought um, foundation because I hate my freckles. We're going on the James Corden show, so that's really cool. Um, obviously, I can't vlog it, but I can vlog going in and all that stuff, but then I have to shut my phone off when I go inside, so. Yeah, that's from five to seven. Gonna try to do my hair before I go. It, it's just shower hair. Like, I just feel really unprepared for all this fancy stuff. I didn't bring a whole bunch of makeup. I didn't bring anything to do my hair. I didn't bring a lot of jewelry. Shoot. I gotta put jewelry on. I got some earrings and stuff. So I'm gonna do that now. And then we'll see you guys soon. Sorry, we don't allow it. Don't. Here's my Shirley Temple. Yeah, really and here's our tiny condo. Let's look at it. Everything smells good. I can't really film myself because we're not supposed to be filming, so I gotta do this quick. Nika's Caesar salad has the anchovies in it. Here's the Parmesan. And this is, I'll just say it's over $30 for this dish, and it's not even a full piece of salmon. There are three Brussels sprouts. I guess when you're rich, you don't eat a lot of food, but you pay a lot for it. And I got a Shirley Temple. You got these baby condiments. Look at how cute they are. Yes, thank you. Look at that. Look at that tiny little. These adorable little things. But we're in this old elevator. And then the thing outside looks like the actual tower of terror. Are we calling an Uber? All the buttons. Like, oh shoot, we didn't press a. <laughs> I don't know where we're oh, going. This could be cool. Wait, where are we going? I don't know. Oh, shoot, I'm going to press it. Part two. Is this where we want to be? No, this is not where we got in. I don't know. No, no, go down to one. The thing no, outside go, is go. like the actual thing where it goes ding ding. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay. Well, sorry I couldn't film at the restaurant. It was too fancy. There's like celebrities and stuff. We didn't see any, like always. So, just had a day. So, we just ate at this super, super fancy place and we could not take any pictures or videos and we did. <laughs> I took a picture of my food. <laughs> We are at the ice cream lab. I was telling Nika about this place. Look at this menu. Blue velvet salt lick crunch. We can watch me. This place is famous for the blue velvet, but we're getting, I'm getting mint, she's getting cookies and cream. So we're pretty excited. I love ice cream, it's my favorite. It's our first time here at, at any ice cream lab. And uh, I was telling her about it online before we came and she doesn't remember. And I was like, what? We're close to one, so we're gonna go. Stop pouring out right before they filming. They make it all. Oh, here's mine. Baby. I got mint. It has Andy's mint in it. And um, basically, there's these two brothers. They have a story in here. So these two brothers, Tommy and Joseph, hate that when you open the milk carton, there's like the ice crystals, or sometimes it's just gross, preservatives, all that stuff. So they make this. So they take all the ingredients and they fresh make it. So they literally just pour the cream in take like a blast of liquid nitrogen, which was all the smoke, 
and then they make it. So it's, it tastes a lot like Dippin' Dots because of that, because they use liquid nit nitrogen to make the dots. And so it's kind of got that consistency and taste, but it's really good. Can I try yours? <laughs> yours is really good, but also this song, Closer by Halsey and the Chainsmoker just came out. Yeah, it's finally getting cold. <laughs> it's really good. Okay, we are here at CBS Studios. I don't know how to film things. How do I? Oh, there it is. It's right up there. <laughs> um, now we're here waiting in line for the James Corden show, so it'll be real fun. Is this the start of James Corden right mm -hmm. here? Just uh, walked a little bit of the ways. The line started moving, so we are gonna go in soon. You gotta go through security, and then go to the bathroom, and then take pictures, and then we're in. Yeah. Aren't you excited, Nika? That's what you think. just got out of the late, 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 late show with James Corden. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. We couldn't film anything obviously inside, but James Corden is the cutest little smushy in the whole world. Aldous Hodge is the hottest man ever. I'm gonna marry that guy so hard. Um, we'll be on CBS tonight, but of course this is gonna go up in like two months. So um, you can go back and see it. it's October 20, 24th. It's the Monday that's October 20 something. Oh, we saw Ron Howard. He's the director of Splash, which is like one of my favorites with Tom Hanks. Uh, Obama's here in LA apparently, so that's pretty cool. Um, and we saw Nick Offerman from Parks and Rec. Yeah, he was at the Hollywood Walk of Fame. And it was super cool. Everything was a lot of fun today. Um, we got to see them. Obviously, we can take pictures or videos, but they were pretty close to us. And then they did this weird laughing thing at the end where we just like laughed for 10 minutes. We did small laughs, medium laughs, big laughs, claps, cheers, claps leading into cheers, cheers leading into claps, laughs leading into cheers, laughs leading into claps. No, we didn't do that much. We did like two of those. We did a lot. No. We were in the Q&A segment. Um, there was a someone who asked a question in front of us and we saw in or we got into it. You can just see us, we're not actually asking anything. Uh, but Aldous Hodge mentioned Hamilton, so basically we're meant to be. Uh, those will be the only famous people we see the whole trip. We tried. We could have gone to the Walk of Fame today and seen Obama. That would have been sweet, but probably not even taking a picture with him because, you know, guns and threats and so the balance bombs. And we rendezvous with Obama, consolidate their gifts. We can end this war on November 4th and vote in the election. Trump or Hillary or Johnson or Stein or McMullen or all the third party vets in. That was a good rap. <laughs> so we're at a ramen place now. Because Nika's the most intolerant, childish, immature person. She won't even get anything. There's stuff that she would like and she's just like, no, I want Chipotle. No, I want Chipotle. Awesome. So just like when we were kids, we have to go two different places just to eat dinner. Um, so it's called Shi Shin Ramen. S-H-I-N. Or is that an A? S -A. It's either Shia Ramen, Shia LaBeouf, or Shia Ramen. Shin. No, it's Shin Ramen. Shin Ramen. And I got Veggie Ramen, my favorite. So I hope it's good here. Better be really good because it's what I'm getting for dinner. That's the update. And then we're going to go to Chipotle and I eat, I guess, because she's a child. So. I don't know how far we have to home, but... I'd rather just eat it at home while watching a scary movie, but life doesn't always work out the way you want it, and you have to learn that as be mature. Good. It was from kind of like a sketchy type of place. It looked like a very small ramen place. There wasn't like a lot of places to sit and stuff. Yeah. 
Let's try it. We're at Chipotle now, because Nico's the worst. But, uh, it is good. You should try mine. Just after dinner, me and Nika got in a big fight. Um, so we're just home now, chilling. I think she's asleep. I think she's been asleep for a long time. I'm about to watch a movie. I'm editing a video that should have been up like, mm, it's over a month ago that I did it. And I usually get one up. One up a week was my goal and it's been over a month since I put a video up. So I was going to do like 10 videos tonight, but I, uh, it takes about an hour just to save one onto my computer before I can put it on YouTube, so it's just unrealistic. Um, maybe I'll get two. I wouldn't bet on it, though. I'll get some tomorrow. I'm going to spend time doing stuff tomorrow because I think all of our plans for tomorrow are canceled, so. I've settled down. I am eating mint ice cream again. <laughs> I love mint. Besides haagen Belgian chocolate, mint of any brand was probably my favorite. So, it's Talenti, the, the gelato. I'm watching Kiss the Girls, Morgan Freeman, Ashley Judd. Pretty good so far. No, I've seen it. I watch it every Halloween. I'm gonna eat one single Dove dark chocolate. I have probably gained so much freaking weight. I ate a whole like pint of haagen already. I had ice cream already today and now I'm eating this. And I was gonna I might, I don't know. I'll probably be sick. But I haven't shown you this yet, so. <clears throat> I bought a dark chocolate pretzel wand from the Harry Potter Universal. I might eat this whole thing tonight. I was gonna eat it with popcorn, but popcorn, ice cream, chocolate, and this. Is that maybe too much for a dessert? <laughs> for a movie snack? Yes. I'll just take one bite now. And God him. Oh, wait, it's this way, because that's why it's thicker. That's really good. That's good chocolate. That's good. Pretzel. And this is really good ice cream. I didn't think I'd like it. The brand. But I like mint everything, so. Okay, I'm gonna watch a movie.